Hello everyone, thank you for tuning in to Metaphysically Me. I am Shannon and this is the daily reading for um, Saturday, December the 6th, 2014. And today I am working with the Spirit Oracle deck by Tony Carmine Salerno and today's card is Forgiveness. Now, um, I'm going to read the back of the card for you before I get into my interpretation. It says, it is time to heal old wounds. Forgiveness is required. Do not allow yourself to be a victim any longer. For in doing so, you only hurt yourself. You are eternally loved. Embrace the love that is being offered and allow it to heal you. So, this card reminds me of... Of course, Jesus on the cross, because that's that's exactly what the image is. But when I think about Jesus on the cross, I really, I know that he, um, like in my mind, I know that he knew he was like born to, for just for this purpose, you know what I'm saying? For him to die on the cross for the sins of everyone else. But um, I know in my heart, if that was me who had to walk that walk, I would be like, when it came time for the cross, like, really, this is what I got to go through? I mean, like, when is it ever going to end? When is the suffering going to end? And so, um, I think that uh, Jesus trust, and he knew that what he, the, the path that he was on was for the greater good for everyone. And so, in doing that, like, through his suffering, he forgave everyone who tacked him onto this cross. And so that is hard to do because, you know, I mean, like I keep saying, I know he had to ask God, like, for real, <laughs> like I have to endure. How long, how long do I have to endure? How long do I have to go through this? Okay. Even as Jesus, because he, he was human. And so, and that would be the human thing to do. And so, um, if you have that question, like how long, how long do I have to go through this suffering? Well, it's really not about how long you go through the suffering. It's really about how you go through the suffering. Um, because nothing in life lasts forever and you have to realize that so if you're in a painful state right now just know that it too shall pass and so and i really feel like that's how jesus really made it through is because he knew that he wouldn't be up there forever and he forgave and he didn't he he had compassion in his heart and so um, this card is asking you to have compassion in your heart regardless if you feel like you have been you know uh stuck to the cross you know what i'm saying nailed to the cross like you can't go no further like your head is hanging down you feel like crap everything's against you you know know that this will pass this will definitely pass and it is um this is the time to forgive instead of like holding grudges against people the people who you know uh nailed you to the cross or whatever and tried to you know I'm getting the witches of salem being burnt at the stake and all of that you have to still um show unconditional love and know that um this too shall pass so this card is asking you for forgiveness for others forgiveness for yourself because i i also feel like there has been some type of communication with the with the blues in the background like there's been some type of breakdown like an argument or something that has really ruffled your feathers and you think that the other person was in the wrong and this is not about being right or wrong this is about respecting everybody and um knowing that everybody's path is different so you cannot control people when you love people unconditionally um it, the rest really doesn't matter you love them for them so yeah they might do some jacked up stuff but that's just them that's who they are and and um it reminds me of like a mother and a child. You know, the child might get on their last nerve. They might be bad as hell. You know, you might want to, you know, 
I don't know, that just get on your last nerves, but you love them anyway. You know, they do dumb stuff like you come home, there's a hole in your wall. You're like, damn, now I got to fix a hole in my wall. And you're pissed off as hell at them, but still, regardless, you still love them because, you know, they're just a kid and that's part of it. And so that's why I'm saying about uh, dealing with people today. And today is a day to f forgive every situation and let it go and just so it can be healed and even like if you i feel like you're gonna have to call somebody up and say um i am uh yeah in the wrong i am totally in the wrong and i hope that you forgive me and it's, it's going to go, like, it's 50-50. Like, I guess some people are going to get a call to say, you know, will you forgive me? And then some people are going to have to reach out and make that call and be like, you know, I hope you, you know, forgive me for what I did. So, with that being said, know that spirit is working in your favor and that these um, hardships that you're going through right now are for your own spiritual growth so those are the messages that i'm getting today i'm sorry it wasn't you know uplifting and great but i do feel like um hopefully i, I explained it in a way where y'all could understand as far as loving somebody unconditionally and forgiving um situations even when you rather just get revenge but that only uh, creates more karma. And what you're trying to do is release karma. So even if you can't talk to the person, I, I suggest that you like meditate and you out loud say you forgive this person and everything that they've done and you forgive yourself and for your role in it too. Because know that uh, usually it takes two people. So you might have started out right, but in the end, both of y'all are wrong. So I hope that helps you along your journey. Um, please like, share, and subscribe, and comment. And as always, I'm Metaphysically Me, and I hope that you are Metaphysically You. Have a good day.